क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टी वन दट्स अगेन अ वेरी नाइस प्रॉब्लम इट्स अ गवर्नर प्रॉब्लम फॉर अ गिवन पोजिशन ऑफ द पॉटर गवर्नर द रेशियो ऑफ द मैक्सिम टू द मिनिमम स्पीड ऑफ द गवर्नर विल बी कंसिडरिंग द लेफ्ट हाफ ऑफ द गवर्नर वेरी नाइस This they have shown one sixty meters, two hundred. This they have shown one twenty meters, two hundred. Okay, so it means this is your n maximum. This is your n minimum. Because if the radius is less, it's a minimum speed. So you will be at the bottommost position. Radius is high, it will be a maximum speed. And uh, certainly they are showing. both of these arms and the links both are same so any moment theta equal to beta no doubt so it means the value of k is 1 and static friction they are not giving anything so we are assuming zero we are assuming this static friction value is equal to zero and they are asking what is the minimum and maximum speed so we are going to apply the equilibrium equation So equilibrium equation, a proper governor we know very well, n is equal to n is n is n n square is equal to eight ninety five by h. Two mg plus capital mg plus minus f. One plus k divided by two mg. And we know very well, this is our h one. And this is our H one. This is our H one. So we can directly uh, write here uh, static friction value is zero, and k value will be equal to one. So this two, this two, and this two, and this two will be cancelled. G, G, and G will be cancelled. So if we apply at the lower position, the n minimum, n maximum, upper position basically. n maximum square is equal to 895 divided by h maximum h is under root of 200 square minus 160 square into small m plus capital m upon small n and n minimum square is equal to 895 by this one under root of 200 square minus 120 square Again, a small m plus capital M upon a small m. So we can directly write this n maximum square upon n minimum square will be equal to everything will be cancelled out. Everything will be cancelled out under root of 200 square minus 120 square upon under root of 200 square minus 160 square, which will be equal to 160 divided by 120, and which is equal to Uh, this one, so n maximum by n minimum, which will be the square root of this 160 by 120, that is 1.154. So this is the right answer for this problem.